Hi everybody, Damien here from Trade the Fifth. Hope you're all well. Um, I just want to give you all a, a quick introduction on our new Bits platform for the Ninja Trader 8 uh, and obviously help you install it as well. So the first thing you're going to do after purchasing, you're going to get an email uh, with a download for the license key. Uh, so download the file, make a note of exactly where you saved it, but don't open it. You don't need to do that. But first of all, we all need to get authorized um, for, for the product first. So to do that, you're going to come up to here to help. You're going to come down to about and you see here where it says machine ID. You need to copy that and you need to email that to info at trade I'll then authorize that machine ID to use the new bits platform. Now what you need to do is you need to install the Ninja Trader add-on. So to do this, we're going to come up here to tools. We're going to come down here to import and then we're going to go Ninja Script add-on. Now it's loaded up. So you're going to get a zip file. So you're just going to select the zip file and you're going to select open. And then obviously you're going to say yes, you wish to authorize these add-ons and continue. I'm saying yes, I've already installed this, but I'm just going to do a pre-install now. So give it a moment. Now it's going to tell you it requires you to shut down and restart the application. So I'm just going to pause this video, shut it down, and then restart it, and we'll carry on from there. Okay, so now I've restarted this. What we're going to need to do now is you're going to start opening up a chart. So we'll come down here to New and down to Chart. Uh, obviously select the chart you're going to be using, so I'm just going to select Apple here quickly. Um, obviously you've got your time zones here, so make sure you pick those out correctly. Click OK. Now the chart has appeared. So what we need to do is we need to add the indicator to this chart. So we're going to do that by right clicking on the chart, come down here to indicators, and then you see here we've got the bias and the bits indicators here. So we're literally just going to select it and then come down here to configured, click add. And again, we're going to do that with bits, click add. We're going to apply it and we're going to click OK. And there you have it. So now you have the, the bits indicator up here. Uh, with obviously the points of control and you have the bias indicator down here. Now obviously the bias indicator, Paul will go into more detail on the on his bootcamp video for you. One well, final thing I just want to show you here are the target prices that are from the bits indicator here. Okay, so I'm just going to expand this out so you can see it's a bit clearer. And what you can see here, you can have the, the different lines. Now the first dots here, they signify basically a 50% times risk. Uh, the yellow ones above here signify a 100% times risk. The purple ones will then signify a 160 times risk. And then this flat line here uh, signifies the 200% times risk. Now again, Paul will go into more detail here on the, on the bootcamp video. Um, but if you do have any other questions or any issues trying to install this, please feel free to email me. You can contact me at info at tradethefifth.com.